Welcome to my December Crew Pack review. So December Crew Pack has been revealed as the Cube Assassin. I'm going to have a look at it quickly. A noble, unstoppable, part of the Glyph Aura set, introduced in Chapter 2, Season 4. As you can see, it's reactive. So if you watch, it's got three stages of reactivity. We're not sure if this is uh, elimination based or damage based as yet. Stage 3 obviously being the brightest, which is pretty cool. Also, I'm not sure if you're going to stay glowing like that or if it's going to kind of fade as it does in this version of it or if it stays glowing the entire match. Okay, the back bling. The cubiest possible cube. Part of the Glyph Aura set introduced in Chapter 2 Season 4. So this one is reactive as well as selectable styles. So, also three stages of reactivity here. Again, we're not sure if, we, if it's linked to eliminations or to damage. So what I think about the selective styles, those of you who have used Mystique in the game and actually transformed into her once she's defeated, you'll notice that she has exactly the same back bling, but hers in game has got like, I'd almost say peaks or spires on, which this version obviously doesn't have. Let's, let's see if we can see. So, okay, so we can only turn the reactivity off on this one. Uh, same as the normal skin itself, you can actually turn the reactivity off as well. So it'll be interesting to see if we can actually select that kind of spire version of it. The only thing I can think of is it might get in the way of the actual aiming down the sights. So once it releases we'll do a skin review and we'll have a look at it. Okay. Pickaxes, also three stages. So this one as you can see, do not disappoint in the cube edge. So what I love about this is if you look at it from the side it's got a very 3D model versus the other pickaxes that are generally quite flat. This is going to be a lot bulkier from the side. Pretty cool. Okay, the wrap. It is showing reactive as well as animated. The animated obviously being the cube in the front. The reactive, however, I don't see any reactivity on it yet, but once we can do a skin review, we can test it out. Obviously, we'll try eliminations and damage again. Hopefully, the wrap will become reactive in that sense. Thanks guys for tuning in, I hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Please let me know in the comments if there's anything we can do better or anything that you want to add to this video. I uh, really appreciate it guys. Thanks, eh? Peace out.